restaurant on the water is scenic, but inspectors found some not so scenic views behind the kitchen door. Just two weeks ago, the state shut down the eatery for live roaches, some even crawling on the crook's line. And with food safety issues this past year, it's the latest restaurant to make my dirty dining list. How long are you here for? Uh, we were here for 18 days. Oh, nice. Jeff Uren and his wife live full time in Las Vegas, but he's a regular in the Sunshine State. So you've been around these parts then before? Oh, yeah. We met Jeff while in Tarpon Springs after learning the state temporarily closed the doors of Dimitri's on the Water on Dodecanese Boulevard. This place was shut down for 26 hours. Uh, they are back open now, but they've had a history of food safety issues. Oh, well. I'm sure after, you know, you make the public aware of this, they'll either take care of it or they won't be here anymore. On August 28th, inspectors found over 20 live and dead roaches in the kitchen on the cook's line, near the drink area, on the shelves, and walk-in cooler. So we went inside this peaceful restaurant on the water. Do you want to talk to us outside? I don't talk to you today. I don't have time to talk to you. Owner Andy Salaveras clearly did not want to discuss the recent roach problem. Do you want to give me a written kind of statement? That I don't happened? give you no statement. But it's not the first time the state has returned to Dimitri's for food safety issues. Over the last year, inspectors came back four other times for follow up inspections after finding the manager on duty not certified, employees not properly trained, cross contamination violations, and no soap in the kitchen for employees to wash their hands. Salaveras did not want to answer any of our other questions either. We just want to talk to you about your inspection no. reports, that's all, and what, the, and what the state found. You know, you know what it found. Right, but what you've done to clean things up. I don't want to talk to you. And this tourist is now hesitant to return to Dimitri's. They're not going to allow you to go and inspect it yourself. I mean, they're not going to take you into the kitchen and let you look and see what you think. So, I mean, you know, yeah, it's a tough decision. Early tonight, we received a written statement from the Salaveras family. It reads in part, quote, We immediately took extreme measures beyond the health department's request and closed our restaurant for three days to refurbish, clean, and sanitize our entire kitchen. To see their entire response and other dirty dining stories we've covered recently, head to our website at abcactionnews.com slash dining.